All right, so it's been a couple hours since our last High Point adventure. And currently we're in... Dallas, Texas. Yeah, not quite. Oh. We're in like, I don't even know how to pronounce the name of this town. It's Laants. Probably gonna butcher that, yep. but... Lanza. Lanza? Pretty sure. Uh, it could be that too. So, we are heading to Mount Arvin. And I'm a little nervous because on the way here, we've seen a lot of snow on the ground. And I know that Mount Arvin is very, very remote and up a road that is just not traveled that much. So, I'm real curious to see what we're looking at here. We may not even get to do it today if it comes, you know, worst case, if we can't get up there. So, we're fixing it that way. So, wish us luck. If you're watching this, then at some point I made it to the top. So, I'll see you there. All right, bit of an update for Mar Mount Arvin. We almost made it to the top. We're about a half a mile from the top of the mountain. And I mean, it's just not great conditions. This uh, Jeep compass can't really make it past this little knoll, even though it's in four wheel drive. But we made it most of the way, so we were just gonna hike the rest on foot. So we'll, uh, we'll be at the top momentarily. New trail project and road improvement made possible by these. Yeah, they need a little more, more money. Can I here make this a little nicer? This is definitely not optimal conditions for this, but we did it. <sighs> At what cost, right? Documented. <sighs> okay, summit of Mount Arvin, the highest point in the state of Michigan. And thank God, because that was a uh, brute of a hike getting up here in the snow. We, I did not, uh, the forecast said there was like a light snow a week ago and that it was pretty much clear skies for the rest of the week. So I assumed anything would be melted. Uh-uh, I guess I underestimated the snow here. So feet are cold and wet and it was a lot longer than half a mile to get here. Probably a mile and a half really. But we did it. We made it to Mount Arvin, thank God because I really, 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 really did not want to come back here again. Walking nearly two miles in the snow was not fun. Uh, but we did it, it's off the list. Check that twice. Yeah, that puts me at 24 down, 26 more to go. So we're gonna head down the mountain now from, uh, how tall is this thing? 1,979 feet. It's only just like a few, just, like a few tens of feet above uh, Tim's Hill. It's about the same height. But it is the highest one we've done so far, but Eagle Mountain should be higher. All right, we walked down to this viewpoint and man, you, you can see very far. You can see all the way down to where it meets Lake Superior, way down there. Never seen Lake Superior before. This is probably the most Northern high point I've done, but the view is, tremendous um but we've parked pretty far down the mountain so we're gonna head down there now hopefully things go well okay so four hours later uh we're in duluth minnesota and we i didn't really want to record anything coming down and then i kind of forgot to end the video when we got back to the car so, checking in, 
Uh, not gonna lie, that one kind of stunk. That was uh, that wasn't fun. But we weren't prepared to do any hiking in the snow, so our feet were wet the whole time, um, and it was just a drag to get up there. And just so far out there, it's just kind of annoying to get to. The high point is kind of supposed to be fun, you know, and I didn't really have a whole lot of fun with this one. So that's a little disappointing. But still got it done, thank God. We got one more that should be a good one, so I'm excited about that. Thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one.